morning, y'all. So it is Monday, January um, 10th. And I am about to get my hair done. I'm about to get it braided. So this is my hair before. I just put it in these braids. It is 7.55. My appointment is for um, 8 o'clock. Yes. So getting some long hip length knotless braids. And I'm trying out color this time. Um, doing a mix. So I'm nervous. I'm used to like black braids. But I just love like black hair. I do love like blonde hair is really cute too. I like blonde, but I do want to try something different. I want to spice it up and you know, just have a, you know, like I don't want to always have to do black braids. You know, I want to hmm, dip and dab. So we'll see how that goes. I did ask for her to make the braid itself a little bit thinner, like not to put as much hair in the braid, like take out a little bit because they do be a little bit on the medium side and i feel like most people's smalls are usually mediums but i feel like a small should be a small and not a medium so they be a little thick and i like to wear buns so i need mine to be a little bit thinner so that it's not a huge bun but yeah that's pretty much all that i got today this is probably going to take about seven maybe eight hours at the most unfortunately so i should be done probably like four or five um, she usually doesn't take any breaks. I will be back when my hair is done. And then I need to go home, finish packing, clean up a little bit before I leave. Because I leave tomorrow afternoon. Me and Michaela are heading to D.C. So, yeah. Look, you can't help it that you popping and they stopping. <laughs> you can't help it that you packing and they lacking. <laughs> you can't help it that you great and they late. You happy and they crappy. <laughs> I ain't got nothing to do with you. That's a damn stop. So right now it is Tuesday, January 10th. My mom is the chauffeur for right now. Um, yeah, she's driving. But yeah, so she's gonna drop us off at the airport. We are headed to DC and we'll be there for pretty much the whole week. I'll see you guys when I get there. Or when I get to the airport, maybe. Don't play with it, don't play with it, don't play with it, don't play with it. have landed in DC and now we are headed to get our bags. I can tell it's a little chilly when I got off the plane, but I don't think it's that cold. I don't know. It's still like 40s, 30s, but I think that's cold. Especially, yeah, in Alabama that would be cold. But I don't know, everybody weather is different. So I'm sure we're gonna head to her mom's next and probably get something to eat. I'm hoping so because I'm starving like Marvin, so. Um, one thing about me, I love to eat. I'ma always eat, okay? If I don't do nothing else, I'ma eat. Might not look like it, but I'ma eat, okay? But, oh yeah, so you guys, I got some braids. Well, I might do a close-up later, but, yeah. I didn't point that out, though. Oh, yeah. Stopped by this Jamaican spot called Irene's. Um, I got I got curry chicken, uh, rice and peas, cabbage, and that was it. Like extra gravy on top of the um, cat. No rice. So it was pretty cool. Um, it wasn't spicy or anything to me. That hers was spicy. She got the curry scrimp. Um, but yeah. So 
it wasn't spicy to me. I feel like I could have went with the jerk chicken. And when I asked him, he said it's really spicy. So I was like, eh, I ain't really trying to, you know, do that in the middle of the night. I ain't trying to wake up with my stomach upset. But yeah, so right now, oh, and then I got this pineapple ginger juice. It's cool. Ginger hits you afterwards. But um, yeah, so now I'm about to shower, eat my food, come back, eat my food watch tv and stuff and just chill and relax and get ready to go to bed because it is 905 so i'm getting in bed a little late that's all right that's okay but yeah i'll see you guys i may or may not talk to y'all after i get out the shower if i don't i'll see you guys in the morning and i know i look a hot mess but that's okay who looks cute when they wake up well i'm sure there are some people who probably do look pretty decent but um yeah, so I left my bunnet and scarf at home. I literally laid it out and packed it, but forgot to put it in the suitcase. So I turned my, so I'm wearing a two-piece silk robe set, and I turned my robe into a scarf. Baby, push come to shove. I'm going to make it do what it do, baby, okay? I just slept in my tank top, and I'm glad I did because, baby, it was burning hot up in here it felt like i was in a furnace okay and they talking about it ain't that cold outside it wasn't that cold outside damn why are we blasting this heat like that girl i was hot okay y'all so this is the lineup for this week i really don't want to put them on if you know you know got the fried chicken sandwich she got the cheeseburger i believe only thing i didn't care for on my sandwich was the pickles they were kind of sweet i don't like sweet pickles but it was good the ambiance and scenery the interior de decor was very nice and it was just a nice cozy vibe that i enjoyed and hopefully i can get some good pictures today I'm not sure if i'm really feeling it i need this mascara isn't i need some eyelashes basically but it's not bad. I'm wearing heels right now, so surprisingly my feet don't hurt. I'm not wobbling too bad. Now when I was taking pictures though, I almost fell a couple of times just trying to like balance, but other than that, I'm all right. And next we're going to a museum, the Renwick Museum or the Renwick Gallery, one of them. But yeah, so, and the weather isn't bad. It ain't like freezing cold either i could have brought a pack of lighter coats in my opinion Good morning guys so right now we're getting ready to go to joe and juice um i think it's like a sandwich spot and smoothie place so i just kept it cute and casual um this white bodysuit black essential sweatpants and the rickies ysl purse and cute and simple the accessories just this g necklace and my year that i was born mm -hmm. 